All right, guys, it is time again. You guys have been tagging me in this video on TikTok. I thought it was a really interesting way of doing a garage entry that I haven't really seen before. Um, so yeah, I wanted to try it out. We are once again going to be using the Toreador, which of course have these rocket boosters in the back. So yeah, I just wanted to try this one out. Thought it looked really cool. If you guys enjoyed, drop a like on the video. Don't forget to subscribe and let's head to the airport. And let's just begin trying out the stunt. Now, I'll also got a couple of stunting rituals later on that I'll be trying, suggested by you guys. And we'll see if any of them give me some more luck here, but... Right, I need to deactivate air brake because, yeah, I accidentally turn it on <laughs> whenever I'm trying to do this stunt. For some reason, whenever I'm doing a stunt with this car, I tend to open up that using key binds. And, okay, that was decent. We gotta really figure out the angle here. I'm not sure if in the TikTok he goes underneath this beam right here or if he goes right next to it. I think he goes underneath it. See, I will try that, but I guess if we go above it, it doesn't really matter. Because the main plan for this stunt is just to use that wall so we can get a spin into the garage. But here we go. That is looking, okay, pretty decent. Yeah, it's gonna take a while to find the perfect angle here. But yeah, I wasn't really sure what video to make this weekend. Then I just saw you guys tag him in this video on TikTok here. And I thought this looked quite interesting. And that's actually decent. You sent us back where I came from. But yeah, we just gotta go a bit lower. And we should end up in the garage here. Anyway, speaking about TikTok, my three latest TikToks have been doing insane. One of them got like close to 1 million. And the other two both got over 2 million views each. Which is insane, and yo, that would have actually been a really cool entry. See, I don't know why my TikTok has just suddenly been popping off. We're getting close to 200k on there as well, so if you guys haven't followed me yet, yeah, go and follow me, and maybe we'll hit 200k in September. Also, guys, do you like this new camera angle? I sort of adjusted it a bit more to the side, and I also made it a bit wider. I think we usually have it like this, but I thought this looked quite cool, and it's actually for a reason as well um, that I can talk a bit about right now. So, so you guys have been asking me to live stream for a very, very long time. A few years ago, I just didn't really feel like it. Like, Twitch has reached out to me multiple times asking me if I'm interested in streaming, and I haven't really been that interested in streaming. However, lately, I just feel like I really want to try out streaming, and I'm going to be streaming on Twitch. So that's why I'm trying out some new camera angles and stuff, sort of just... Yeah, testing to see what I can like put on the wall over here and stuff to make it look a bit cooler in the stream and of course in these videos as well. Because yeah, we got a bunch of games coming out like this winter. For example, in November we got Forza Horizon 5, which looks insane. And then we also got Call of Duty Vanguard coming out, which will also bring a new Warzone, which I actually play a ton off cam as well. Then we got some new updates coming to GTA Online. We got the GTA Expanded and Enhanced version, whatever that means. So yeah, we got a bunch of games coming out. Uh, as you guys know, lately I've been playing more with you guys as well, doing races and stuff, which we can also do, of course, on stream. See, so, yeah, I don't really have a specific date as of right now, um, but yeah, I'll keep you guys updated, of course. Let's give this a few more tries, and then we'll try out some stunting rituals to see if they can give me some luck. And this is an awful attempt. Yeah, where am I going with this? Come on, I want to go below it. No, damn, this was really tricky. It looks super easy in a TikTok. Like, it makes it look so effortless, but I just can't seem to do it. Okay, let's do one more. And then continue with some rituals. That is an awful attempt, though, actually. Not too bad. Just kind of missed the spin. Um, but yeah, let's bring out some rituals. And let's see if they can give me some more luck. Right, so first one. Try doing it in first person. I feel like this is a stunt that could actually very easily be done in first person. Because you don't really got to control a lot. You just got to angle the car and boost. We hit the wall and we started flying towards the garage. So yeah, not too bad. And it's really difficult not to turn your head with the car when you're in first person. And let's give each ritual like five attempts in today's video. So this will be the third one. Am I going the right way here? Yeah, kind of almost made it into this garage. <laughs> All right, number four. Come on. I feel pretty good. We're going towards the garage. I'm spinning. Okay, just a bit more speed and we're there, honestly. I believe. Oh, that's not good. Mm, nope. This is this is not where I'm supposed to go. Okay, next ritual. Do the stunt with five stars of police after you. Oh boy. Alright. One, two, three, four, five stars. Here comes the helis. Okay, let's go. Dude, this would be so sick if I could hit this while the cops are after me. Come on. No, we can't miss it now. Alright, number two. Come on now. This would be so sick with the helis after me as well. Oh, oh, no. Nah. I'm not sure if they're on their way up in the garage or not. Let's go find out. That's actually pretty good. Come on. Yes. No. I just gotta hit it a bit better. Come on now. Oh, no, no, no. Redo. <laughs> Redo on that one. Not sure what made me get such a weird jump, but there we go. It's looking better. Attempt number four is also pretty good. Oh, get the heli. Oh, I imagine I had missiles on there. I would have been able to blow them up in midair. All right, Franklin. Last one. Here we go got this. Yeah. 
No. Ah. Oh. Okay. No. This ritual did not work. Uh, change your vehicle color to chrome. I don't think I've actually ever almost done a stunt with a chrome vehicle. So yeah, let's do that in three, two, one. There we go. It's now chrome. Let's see how we do here. This car is actually really good looking in chrome. Got a lot of nice lines and stuff on it. And did I really just land on a cop? Are you kidding me? Guys, come on. <laughs> what are the odds of me hitting him? Okay, I cleared the wanted level. Attempt number two. Here we go. Good jump, I think. Yes. No spin, though. Just gonna go back where I came from. Number three. Let's go. Oh. Ooh, okay. That was pretty good. We just got a really slow spin there for some reason. And yeah, we just gotta hit the wall a bit better, I think. Attempt number four. That was very bad. <laughs> and the last one with the chrome car. Let's go. Where am I going with this? Straight into the next ritual. That's where I'm going. <laughs> Turn your headset the other way around. Okay, just gotta make my car red first real quick. Wait, how can it feel so weird just turning it around? Is my left ear bigger than my right? I feel like I can't even fit my ear into this one. <laughs> Anyways, here we go. The headset is on the other way and it feels very strange. Just the way it's sitting on my head. Um, okay, not too bad. Okay, number two. Man, this is very uncomfy for some reason. I gotta say, it's a lot nicer to have this wire on this side, though, because it doesn't have to go across like this. Not sure if that's something you can just change. But let's see here. No, what are you trying to do here? Backflip? Number four. Let's go. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. Am I deactivating it? I'm activating the boost maybe a bit too early. I don't know. Really tough time figuring out the angle here. Okay, no. Wasn't that good either. Okay, no. This was very uncomfy. There we go. Oh, that feels so much better. Stunt ritual. Use a no sleep hoodie. Well, I already got mine on as well as the cap. But I do want to show you guys something that we have for drop number two. Hold on. These are so sick. So we got this custom no sleep necklace. This one is silver. And then we also have a gold one. Gold one looks like this. Dude, they turn out so sick. So yeah, these necklaces will be part of Drop 2 coming very, very soon to No Sleep, which is my clothing brand. Drop 2 got a bit delayed because we had some issues with the, the postal services and stuff like that. Some orders got stuck for some reason um, in the mail. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that everybody's gotten their hoodie by now. And can we enter this? Oh, dude, there wasn't a spin, but yeah, still could have entered it. So if you haven't already, check the description, go and follow No Sleep on Instagram. And we're going to be doing a giveaway on one of these necklaces as well. And then Drop 2 is going to be coming out very soon, which is going to have t-shirts as well as hoodies and with some brand new designs. But come on out. The No Sleep Ritual. Okay. That was a bit of a weird spin. I didn't quite make it in. Let's do one more here. And then select the next ritual. No. Oh, God dang it. Why is this so tricky? It looks so easy on the TikTok. Do the stunt as Lester or Paige. Let's go for Lester. I don't think we've ever done a stunt using him, so let's see if he's got what it takes. Come on. Not sure if we've done a stunt with this guy or not. Let's try it out. All Lester just is just, yeah, keep calling you in GTA Online. It's so annoying. Let's see here. Oh, okay. Not too bad, Lester. See what you got in attempt number two, I guess. Oh, damn, I keep activating it way too early, I think. That was almost a bit too late, but yeah, I feel like I'm starting to get some better attempts now. Number four. Come on, we got this. Or you got this, Lester. Oh, maybe this garage? No. All right. Last one. Mr. Lester Crete. Oh, 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 that could have actually been really good. This went a bit too far. No, okay, Lester, you did not tell what it takes. Let's go back to Franklin. And also, actually, all the rituals that I had left. I keep a big document with just a bunch of rituals. If you guys have any new ones, just post them down in the comments. And I will use them the next time that we do rituals. But let's go. Now we gotta try hard and really just try and nail this stunt. Come on. Anybody need to look at the TikTok again? To figure out... Oh, that was the best one so far. It was so clean. I went underneath this thing as well. Nope. Let's go straight back to the start. <laughs> and we go again. <laughs> all right. Let's see here. Second time luck. Let's go. Ah, a bit too far. Almost, almost flew back again for another try. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, I feel like I'm starting to get the timing down. I'm starting to get the timing down. Hold on. Need to activate it a bit later. And also have a bit more of an upwards angle, but that was a bit too much. <laughs> Come on! 
Nice! Okay, yeah, we kind of bumped into the edge there, but still, made it into the garage. Nice. All right, there we go. Finally managed to hit the stunt. Went for a few rich shows, but yeah, try harding was the only thing that actually works. So let's take a look at the stunt in a cinematic replay. Yeah, I may have forgot to save the cinematic replay. So I looked through the files, the cinematic replay wasn't there, unfortunately. So yeah, no cinematic replay for today, but we still managed to hit the stunt, of course. So if you guys did enjoy it, drop a like on the video. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll catch you guys later. So until then, take care, and let's drop that beat.